In this video, I will discuss an interesting technique for fine tuning large language models to a specific domain. So, this technique is known as retrieval augmented fine tuning. Okay, so this is from researchers at Berkeley, Meta, and Microsoft. So, what is the key idea over here? So you can think of training an LLM, right, in different ways. Uh, so the idea over here or the analogy over here is how do you prepare an LLM for an exam? So the first approach is your closed book or supervised fine tuning where you bake in all the knowledge at training time and your test happens, you just query and the model based on its training uh, you know, data and the way it has trained, it gives you the answer, which could be the right answer. Okay. The next is an open book technique or your retrieval augmented generation kind of technique where the model can also use external docs at inference or test time. So basically you can query and it can make use of external data. Uh, you can do retrieval augmented generation and it can give you the right answer. Now, how is raft different from say a rag or your supervised fine tuning? So the idea over here is that you can teach an model which has been trained already, right? Further by making use of these external docs, right? So you are basically teaching the model how to make use of external docs at test time. Okay. So what happens typically in a retrieval augmented generation kind of scenario is that you can have, you know, your external documents, right? And there is a retriever. Now this retriever can retrieve K documents or specific segments of the document, which are appended to the user's prompt. So this is how LLM gains access to the new knowledge, right? But this K documents, in these K documents, some of these documents may be significant, some of them may not be significant. Okay. But the LLM has this entire thing as context and then it tries to give an answer. Now, what if, if you train the LLM, okay, with data like this, okay, where you have the relevant answer along with sampled negative documents. Okay. And then you are asking, uh, you also have the answer, the correct answer and your question and you are training the LLM in a supervised fashion like this. So this is your retrieval augmented fine tuning. And when you are testing it, you are doing your typical rag based top K test. Okay. Or inference. So what happens is that when you are training your uh, LLM like this, Okay, whereby you are giving data in the form of you have your original question, right? You have a, a you have a set of documents and a corresponding chain of thought style answer generated from one of this document in this document set. So you can have two kinds of documents over here. One is called Oracle documents, which is exactly the document from which the answer uh, to the question can be deduced and distractor documents which don't contain any uh, relevant information. And this Oracle document need not be a single document. It can also be a multiple documents. So that is what they are saying over here. So you, you have a question, you have an answer to the question, you have a relevant document and you have a set of non-relevant documents. Okay. The document set can contain set of relevant document and set of non-relevant documents because practically in RAG, this is what happens. The retriever actually retrieves a top K documents out of this top K document. Some document may be very relevant and some document may not be relevant, but the LLM is not trained in your usual RAG for, you know, very good differentiation among those documents. Okay. It is trying to generate an answer based on that context. Um, whereby all top K answers are present. But here in Raft, because the LLM is given these kind of uh, documents as um, these kind of uh, input, right? It is actually able to differentiate between among the distractor documents, which is the relevant document. And based on that, it tries to deduce an answer. 
okay so they have an example over here like this there is this question the oberoi family is part of a hotel company that has a head office in what city and here is your answer the answer says that the oberoi family is an indian family that is famous and the head office is in delhi okay here is your context these are various documents one is the oberoi family is an indian family uh, oberoi group second is it located in city center of jakarta this is a negative document okay jw marriott hotel it is operated by the ritz carlton uh, hotel company then there is another document which says the oberoi group is a hotel company with its head office in delhi so some documents over here are relevant to this question some are non relevant now given the question and this context and answer above the answer is actually the oberoi uh, group is a hotel company with its head office in delhi right provide a logical reasoning for that answer please use the format of reason answer basically this format and this is the, the ground truth answer so this is their raft training data now when your llm is trained on this data they observed that its performance on rag increases for a domain so if you are working on some specific domains like say healthcare finance right it's not open uh, domain question answering but it is more more specifically certain specific domains so if you are working on select domains this technique could improve your rag performance on that domain and what they are saying is that if you train on the golden only data okay whereby you are not having distracted document but you are just having only the a document a relevant document where answer is there the llm can also memorize the answer now this memorization is also important in certain scenarios where you want the exact answer so this is a technique to actually improve your rag performance so they have given the other details over here like on what data set did they uh, you know train it so they trained it on pubmed qa which is a question answering data set tailored for only biomedical research question answering it mainly focuses on answering medical and biology questions based on a given set of documents they tried it on trained it on hugging face torch hub and tensor flow hub api documentation basically uh, right this is the api bench which they proposed in the gorilla paper natural question so these are the various different uh, data sets from which actually they evaluated their model and all baselines so they considered the following experiments one is llama 7b chat model with zero shot prompting um, uh, this is the commonly used instruction tuned model for qa tasks with clearly written instructions but no reference documentation then they tried it with llama 2 chat with rag similar to the previous setting but difference they had the reference context then they did domain specific fine tuning with zero shot prompting so performing standard instruction fine tuning without documents in the context then they did domain specific fine tuning with rag equip a domain specific fine tuned model with external knowledge used in rag so the knowledge uh, the model doesn't know it can still refer to the context so that is what they did over here and they say that this shows you know the raft shows higher performance when compared to plain rag or just supervised fine tuning rag right supervised fine tuning plus rag this is just domain supervised fine tuning this is uh, plain llama 2 this is llama 2 plus this thing rag over that it shows better performance that is what they are saying over here so this is an interesting approach whereby you are actually improving the llm for better performance on uh, rag and you are trying to bring in in domain kind of in domain fine tuning so that is the interesting part about this particular uh, paper and they already have released the code for it uh, it's available on azure as well uh, and they are also saying that uh, this there is this microsoft meta blog which talks about you know how you can do it on uh, azure basically how you can perform a raft based uh, fine tuning on azure uh, so they have a tutorial over here uh, over here that is what they are talking about okay but the idea is quite uh, interesting and uh, this is the paper so you can look at the paper for further details on metrics and uh, you know the performance of this particular model so this is a short video on this technique uh, called raft retrieval augmented fine tuning 
which is about adapting a language model to a domain specific rack. That is a key idea over here. So you can take a pre-trained LLM and then you can do uh, this kind of a post training enhancement for domain specific, improving the performance of domain specific retrieval augmented generation. So I hope this video is useful to you. If you like the video, please like, share, subscribe to the channel. I will be sharing these links uh, in the description of the video. You can check it out. See you in another video.